Hey, it's Mike from Party of Four Crafts back again. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to get a negative effect with your engraves. And by negative, uh, you probably already know how to engrave a word, but how do you engrave everything except that word? That's what we mean by negative. So you can see I created this metal for a school that the words are unengraved and everything else is engraved. So that's what I'm going to show you how to achieve. So it seems simple. It seems like you would just take some white text and put it over a, a black shape, but it doesn't work that way. If you put this into the, the Glowforge, the Glowforge would engrave the entire box and then it would try to engrave the word over it, but the word is white, so it wouldn't do anything, and you would just get a black box. So next step, you, you would think you could convert this to a path, and then take that path and cut it out of the engrave, and that kind of works with one caveat. Um, when you do that, and you go path exclusion, now if you wanted to cut the outside of this box by putting a red outline around it, then it also cuts out the letters. And that's probably not what you want. You probably want it to cut the outside and then engrave everything except the letters. So to do that, you'll have to add another box around it. So turn off the outline for that one. And then I'll add another box of the same size around it. Turn off the fill color and add an outline. And so now I have the red outline around the box, but without having the red outline around those words. So that right there achieved the negative effect. And if you want an unengraved rim around the edge, because sometimes if you cut right up to an engrave, it doesn't look great the thinner part around the edge so sometimes I'll just make this outside part a bit bigger and then that white frame that you have around that entire thing will be unengraved and it'll cut with a border around it and then your your negative text sticking up out from your black engrave. So that's it that's the main way to to get the negative effect uh, you cut it out of the black engrave, add another outline around it to cut around the outside. For something like this where it's round, um, it's a little bit more difficult. And on this one down here, I had to use some cut functions to cut the 2020 in an arc and then just make this part black and then cut this part out of the, the bottom engrave. So I had to break the path here and here and then connect it and make the arc and then subtract it from there and then cut it here and here and then close that path and then exclude it, cut it here, 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 connect it and exclude it. So this part was a little bit more complicated. There might be an easier way to do it, but I always do it the way I know how and it works. And eventually maybe I'll discover that easier way. All right, that's it. I hope you learned something today. If you'd like to see when new topics come out, just click the subscribe button and I'll see you next time.